Guys, get excited because thanks to HyperX, I'll be giving away one of the headsets I wear in my videos. Their Cloud Alpha headset has padded super subs leather ear cuffs for ultra comfort that fits even the largest head sizes. The headset sports a detachable noise cancellation mic. And finally, the Cloud Alpha works on PC, PS4, Xbox One, and pretty much any platform that has an aux in. If you guys want to win the headset, hit the link in the description now and follow the instructions to enter. Good luck, guys. Guys, we can finally learn who he is. Yes! What's, what is he writing? You will regret this. Oh, no. Hey, what's up, guys? EY Stream back here with another episode of our scary survival series. And today, guys, we are going to be trying to finally talk to test subject three and maybe, hopefully, fingers crossed, learn more about who he is, where he came from, who the scientist is, and what is up with this world and whether or not it is Curse. If you guys are excited, make sure right now, go down to the section below and hit the like button, guys. We're going to try and reach 2,000 likes on today's video. That'd be absolutely insane. If you guys are new to the channel, welcome. Make sure to slap the subscribe button and hit the little bell icon to ding, ding, ding to never miss an upload, guys. But let's go ahead. And as you can see, I built a brand new base of operations. It's, a, it's not, it's nothing fancy. It's just got, you know, like a crafting table, furnace, some chests and another portal here. And it is right under the zombie village where the lab is. Now you're probably thinking, EY Stream, are you crazy? Why did you build a base where basically the haunted lab is at? Like, I mean, that sounds pretty stupid. Now I know I didn't really want to do this either, but basically I needed a way to get materials while still keeping an eye on test subjects and making sure he doesn't escape from the cage we left him in from the last episode, guys. Because here's the thing, if he escaped through our hands, while I was getting materials at our other house, I would have been so heartbroken. Like, I would have been really, really sad. After all this effort, we would have lost him. So I built a little base here so I could constantly check on him to make sure he is still in that cage. Now, if you guys have no idea who Test Subject is, and you haven't been giving up the episodes, you don't know what he is, and the fact that he's basically scarier than Herobrine and Green Steve combined, make sure to go watch my previous episodes by going ahead and in the little eye in the top left or right hand corner, go watch them now so you guys know what's going on or hit the link in the description below. But basically, the good thing is, is he's still in that trap. The bad news is, is he really hasn't moved. He's still just crouching down here and looking depressed. But hopefully, we will be able to talk to him in today's video, guys. But basically, the reason why I needed to collect materials and build a nether portal here was because I wanted to build a potion brewing stand. And I wanted to make a potion brewing stand because I wanted to make some potions of weakness. Because if you guys remember, in episode 3, Test Subject absolutely annihilated us. He wrecked us so hard and absolutely killed us in seconds. So here's the thing, before I let him out of that cage, I want to throw a potion of weakness at him to hopefully that if he does try to kill us, he won't do enough damage to kill us and we'll be able to escape before he can, you know, utterly wreck us. Because that, that is like not what I want to happen in today's video. So yeah, I am going to make some potions of weakness first. So let's go ahead and do that. Now, I believe you need a fermented spider eye. We don't need gas tears for that. But we are going to need some blaze powder, sugar. All right, cool, cool, cool. And mushrooms. So let's go. Oh, we're also going to need to grab some glass. All right, so first off, let's go ahead and make uh, some glass bottles. I reckon we'll just make two splash potions of weakness. I think that's all we're going to need. All right, yeah, I've got some water still left in my cauldron. Let's go ahead and fill up our water bottle. All right, luckily, I've got my water bucket here. And all right, cool. We got two... Bottles of water set up. Now, I believe you are going to need fermented spider eyes to make the potions of weakness, which I believe, yeah, there we go. There's the recipe. Sugar, mushroom, and our spider eye. All right, let's chuck the blaze powder in our brewing stand, put in the water bottles, and chuck in our fermented spider eye. So, all we got to do is go ahead and wait for our potions to be brewed so we can go ahead and get our potions of weakness. Now, in the last episode, guys, a ton of you in the comments below said we should either try and talk to test subject through the chat, because he might be an entity that can use chat, or by using signs. Now, I reckon we're going to try using signs first. If that doesn't work, we will try chat. But yeah, hopefully one of them will work, and we'll finally be able to learn more about who he is and where he came from, etc, etc. Now, to do that, of course, we are going to need to craft some signs. I better do that right now, so let's go ahead and do that. Alright, now, I'm not sure how many signs I'm going to need. I think I'll just craft a ton just in case. 
um, so that, uh, you know, just in case we have a really long conversation, because I really don't know whether or not he's going to want to talk, and if he is, well, obviously, we're going to need a lot of signs. So here we go, guys, I'll make, all right, we're gonna need, uh, yeah, eight sticks, all right, cool, and then we'll go ahead and we'll chuck the wood all up here, all right, why can't I not craft signs? I believe, yeah, there's the crafting recipe for signs, there we go, and I'll just craft as many as I can right now. Bang! All right, nine signs, mm, should we, I feel like we need a little bit more than nine signs, so let's go ahead. I'll craft a few more. There we go. And we'll chuck the sticks back here. Ba bam, ba bam, bam, ba bam, bang. All right. Uh, 15 signs. All right. Let's just make a few more just to be safe. All right. 16 signs. I reckon that's enough. Hopefully. All right. Our potions of weakness are done. We'll chuck the gunpowder in, turn them into splash potions for us to throw at test subject before we let him out of there. And that should be good. Now, hmm. I'm just thinking if we're going to let him out, maybe we should wall off this side with obsidian just so he isn't able to escape because. Yeah, if we do let him out and he just runs down here to the lab, he might be able to get some resources or something. So let's grab some obsidian. I'm going to make an iron door real quick. All right, let's do that. And that way we can block off the entrance and he won't be able to get through. So what I'll do is I will also make a lever so we can get out of our little thing here. All right, there we go. We'll craft the lever. All right, and let's go ahead and fill this entrance in with obsidian just so he can't get out. So all right, we'll fill this entire section in here with obsidian, and then we'll go ahead and chuck the iron door right here, just like that. And we'll also go ahead and get the lever. So we can only open and close it from our side. That way he won't be able to escape out of the spawn room we have there. All right, hopefully, all right, cool. Our splash potions of weakness are done, guys. I'm gonna chuck all this other stuff I don't need back in the chest. All right, I need the signs, I do need those. Uh, we don't need that, don't need that. And I believe we are good to go. All right, cool. I've got our two Splash Persons of Weakness, guys. Whew. Are you ready, guys? This could be the moment where we finally are able to contact Test Subject 3. All right, guys. Let's open up the cell. I'm going to try and... Can I close it? All right, there we go. Close the door, guys. Whew. We're trapped in here with Test Subject. All right. Is he going to move? Test Subject, are you... All right, guys. He's still stuck in the depressed state from last episode. Maybe if I... Some of you guys were saying it's because I turned off the lever. If I hit the lever now and turn it on, nothing happens. All right, if I just flick it a few times, I don't know, guys. Yeah, nothing happens, guys. A bunch of you were saying maybe it's because I turned off the lever that he went depressed or stopped moving. But I just flicked the lever quite a few times there, guys, and he's still not moving. So I guess that's clearly not the case. All right, we're going to let him out. Let's go ahead. Mm, oh, should we? Yeah, okay, let's, let's throw the potion of weakness first. All right, bam, all right, good. There we go, all right, that hit him. You can see the particle effects coming out of him. Let's break out the cell, all right. Iron bar one, and all right, bang. Grab that. All right. All right, we've opened up the cell. What is he doing? Oh, guys, guys, he's moving. Test subject, hello? Hello, test subject? What is he doing, what is he doing? Hey, okay, he's trying to escape. It does seem like he's not able to get out. All right, no, all right. What is he doing? What is he doing? Is he trying to run around? What is it? Okay, um, I'm not sure what's going on, guys. Test subject is just running around the room. I think he's trying to escape. What is he? What is he doing, guys? Test subject, hello? Oh my gosh, he's trying to punch me. What? Oh, luckily he, did, he didn't do any damage. The potion of weakness clearly has gone ahead and removed any damage effects he can do. That's really, really good for us. He's just running around the room, guys. He must be trying to escape or something. I don't, I really don't understand what's going on. What is he doing? He's running around. Clearly, he might, yeah, he's trying to escape, guys. He's clearly trying to escape. All right, this is our moment. What, dude, you, he can't get out of the obsidian. This is so good. That's so good for us. He can't escape. The potion of weakness has clearly weakened his senses and he's not being able to do any damage. Let's go ahead. This is as good as chance of any now that he's moving again. Let's try and talk to him. So here we go, guys. All right, I, I reckon, first question, who are you? That's what we want to know. All right, who are you, test subject? Oh, he's reading the sign, he's reading the sign. He's reading the sign. All right. He's looking at me. What does he want? Oh, okay, we should probably give him some signs. That way he can talk to us. All right, I think he understands. Guys, we could finally learn who he is. Yes! What's, what was he writing? You will regret this. Oh no. Okay. Come, I asked him 
who he was and you will regret. Okay. What does that mean? I don't... Okay. Is he going to... I don't know whether he's going to try and kill us. Let's just throw another... Throw another potion of weakness on him. Throw another potion of weakness on him. Why are you doing this? He's actually talking to us, guys. All right. Why are you doing this? All right, let's respond to that. All right, all right. Um, I want to know who you are. We'll just let him read that. I can't believe this, guys. We're actually having a conversation with Test Subject. We're actually communicating him, and he's actually writing back. All right, there goes the sign. What is he writing this time? We'll pick up this sign. I, I kind of want... I want to keep my signs. Error. Error? What error? What? Error? What? Is he, not a, is he a machine? Wait. What? You do not have admin permissions. Wait. Does that mean he's a machine? Guys. Is test subject a machine? Or is it a person? Or is he both? Oh, wait, 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 wait. All right, let's destroy the sign here, guys. I need to know, who is your admin? Because, guys, maybe the admin... Maybe the admin is the scientist. Like, I'm, this is not too much of a crazy idea, honestly, because you do not have admin permission. Guys, if he's ha half machine, I mean, he looks half machine, perhaps, maybe, his admin is the scientist. Wait. What is he writing? What is he writing, guys? The one who must not be named. What? His admin is the one who must not be named? What does that mean? What does that mean, guys? Ah! Oh, what? The one who must not be named? That sounds really bad. Maybe the scientist did something horrible to test subject. Is that why he can't name him? Wait, 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 all right. Let's destroy the sign real quick. Um, all right. What do you mean? Like, what? All right, what do you mean? All right, he's reading the sign. He's reading the sign. I, I honestly don't... I can't understand what's going on right now, guys. There goes the sign, all right. What is he writing, guys? You will be... Cursed. You will die. What? Okay, let's keep our distance. He said, you will be cursed, you will die. But he's not attempting to kill us. Is he talking about his admin? Maybe he's talking about the scientist. Maybe the scientist is going to kill me. Maybe test subject's actually good. Maybe he's being controlled by the scientist through this, like, mechanical cyborg thing. All right. But just so he knows that... Maybe, maybe we can talk to the human part of him. Maybe we can get past, maybe we can bypass the admin. I don't know. All right, uh, let's, I come in peace, all right? Let's say I just want to find the scientist, all right? Scientist, all right, cool. Maybe, maybe he'll understand that maybe he could team up with me. Maybe we could work together to take out the scientist. That'd be incredible, guys, if we could actually do that. What's his response, all right? We're about to find out, guys. What does he say? Please, maybe he'll team up with us. Don't mess with what you don't understand. Okay? Okay, clearly he doesn't want to team up with us. Is that a warning? Maybe he's warning us not to mess with the scientist. I don't know. That seems like a... Pr that's really ominous, guys. That seems like something really bad is going to happen. If I try and find the scientist. Alright, come on. I mean, he's just not telling us. I just please. Alright, please. I need I need to know. Not I want to know. I need to know what's going on, guys. Please. Test subject, please. I know. I know you're saying don't mess around with what I don't understand, but I need to find out. I need to know whether or not this world is cursed. Alright, he's destroying the sign. What is his response? What is his response? Then know this. You will 
Die, okay, keep our distance again. Is he talking about... Wait, okay, why are we scared? He's got the potion of weakness on him, so we basically can't do anything. He's locked in this room. I'm not gonna die to you, test subject. You're crazy, okay? Just, alright, um, just look. Here, I'll let you free. If you tell me what happened. I feel like that's a fair deal. If, if he tells, I can't spell happen. I can't spell happen. I can't spell happen. If he tells us what happened, we can let him free. Alright, come on, test subject, surely. Please, please, come on. He's reading the sign. Oh, okay. Okay. He might... I think he's going to tell us what happened. He's going to tell us what happened. You've given me all the energy? What, what is he on about? I need to... Es es escape? What is he on about? I haven't given him anything. I haven't given him any energy at all. It's not like he's... Wait. Can test subject take out, like, our soul? What? I don't... I don't understand. All the energy he needs to escape. He can't escape. He's stuck in this room, guys. He legitimately cannot escape. I don't understand. Oh my gosh! He's gone! What? No! Ah! We lost him again! Ah! I'm done! How? What? Did... You've given me all the energy I need to escape. Did he steal some of my... Like, I don't know. Did he steal, like, my life or something to use... Do... What did he do? How did he get enough... He overcome the potion of weakness to... I don't know what he's done, but he's gone. He's vanished. How? What? What is going on, guys? What am I supposed to do now? I actually don't... No. What am I actually supposed to do now, guys? I don't know. Like, oh my gosh, lightning. What? What are all the lightning strikes going on? Okay, I'm losing hearts. Oh my gosh, I have nausea. Oh, why do I have levitation? I'm floating to the... What is going on? What? I'm dead. Okay, what? I can't. What just happened, guys? EY stream was killed by magic? What's going on? What? What's going on right now, guys? What's actually going on? We got hit. There was like all that lightning inside the room. We got nausea. We got levitation. And then we were dead. Okay. Um. I don't know what a, I don't. Guys, what? We need to check the room. We need to check. We, get, we need to get back there right now. We need to check the room right now. I don't know what just happened. We suddenly had all these effects on us. There was lightning everywhere. Is this a what? Wait. I'm just trying to remember what he said. He said, you will regret this. Don't mess around with what you don't understand. He did warn us, guys. He said we were going to die, and we really did. What's going on? What is going on right now? Let's, okay. Open the door. Just peek in. All right. I'm just gonna stay out of that room for now. He's gone, guys. We lost him again. Ugh, that sucks so much. But we did finally get to talk to him, and... I don't know what's going on, guys. He seemed really... He seemed really shaken. The one thing I can tell is that he must be getting controlled by someone, because he had that error where the... I didn't have admin permissions, which is really interesting, which might suggest that he's part machine. But his steam... It seems... He is still out to kill us. I honestly don't know where to go from here, guys. I need you to let me know in the comments below what I should do in the next episode. I honestly don't understand. Is he back? Wait, is he back in the cell? Maybe? Could he be? Okay, I guess I got my hopes up a little too much there. He's not back in the cell. I don't know what, honestly, we're supposed to do right now because he's gone. We could try spawning him in again and try talking to him again, but I guess that's the only kind of idea that's coming to my head right at the moment, guys is just try and spawn him in again. But if you have any better ideas, please let me know in the comments below, guys. That brings us to the end of today's video. I hope you guys have enjoyed. And finally, we did actually get to talk to Test Subject. So I guess that is the positive of today's episode. But we did lose him, which is the bad news. But until next time, guys, anyway, stream out. Bye!